Right, hello, it's Saturday, and I kept the uh, parallel, which I call wizard sleeve. Rude, I know. I kegged that on um, Thursday. I forced carve it. Normally I let them sit with carb, half C carbonating over two or three, five days. But I haven't forced carb for so long. I overdid it. <laughs> fucking hell. Do you know what? I've got to fucking I've got to sort my pipe work out on my um, on my kegs and my taps because I just emptied a whole uh, CO2 bloody bottle. Pissed off, had a leak. I didn't notice it the other day. Just sorted that out. Um, I think what's happened is, well, obviously it's the beer lost all its carbonation. I don't know why. Come out of the head. I'm going to renew all the pipe work and sort it all out in the next few weeks. Um, I'm going to brew again in the next couple of weeks, but I say until that time, I've got my. <laughs> oh, excuse me. Um, just have some fresh, fresh bread with buffalo wing sauce. Oh, lovely. Anyway, until um, I've made my um, <clears throat> false bottom, or no, I've got my false bottom, I'm going to make that. I just can't be asked. I could do, I could use the bottom of another keg, which I've got, not plenty of spares. But you know what, I don't know what size holes or anything to put in, so I'm just going to buy one. Again, wait till payday. So, um, it's not clear at all. But I wouldn't expect it to. The amount of protein that went into that, I wouldn't expect it to clear. But Joe, you know who cares? I know a little snifter. <sighs> Bloody hell. <laughs> yeah, citrusy. Smells nice. Uh, oh, yeah. I'm getting Simcoe now. Oh, I have a little taste anyway. <laughs> Not bitter at all because I hate, excuse me, hate bitter um, pales or IPAs, especially IPAs, because I think the bitterness and the hoppiness is just too much. Um, but obviously uh, a pale ale should nowhere near be as hoppy as an IPA. That is cracking. I like that. I like any beer, but do you know what? That's that's spot on. That is spot on. That's just got the right amount of hoppies. Hoppies? Hoppies. Not not bitter at all. Mm. I'm pleased with that. Hopefully it'll get better over the next few days. Um whether it'll last a few days. <laughs> Do you know what? I'm pleased. I'm pleased with my little system. Um, yeah. I've proved the uh, Herm system works, which was always a bit of a, a uh, who knows. That works well. The only thing that did work well was the false bottom. The mash tun and the maintaining the thing, and the maintaining temperature, and that was spot on. Great. Still got to sort out that PID, but I can do it sort of manually at the first for a chill, to make some money. Um, but yeah, I'm pleased with it. Um, will I change anything? Bigger shed? <laughs> no, it's alright actually. Um, I'll put a sink now around because the bloody bowl was on the other side. When, when the board is in the way, I can't get to it. But Joe, well, that can be moved about. I can move that, that's not the end of the world. But yeah, I'm pleasantly chuffed. So, to the new brew shed and the new brewing system. Cheers. Sludger. Mm, lovely. <laughs> 